This is going to be a tutorial on how to get the weather on your desktop using Geek Tool. To download it, you got to go to projects.tinesilk.org slash en slash geek tool and then click on download under Geek Tool 3.0. Then just click on Geek Tool 3.0 to download it. Once Geek Tool is installed, open Safari, go to yahoo.com, and then enter where you live. I'm going to use New York City as an example for this tutorial. Then click on Extended Weather Forecast, copy the URL, go into the text edit document, and replace my location and paste. Then copy all that, open up Geek Tool in System Preferences. First, you've got to add a group. I'm going to call this one Weather. Activate it, then add a shell, and paste the script. You can see that's what we copied in text edit. Then set the refresh to 30 seconds. Then go back into text edit and copy that. And drag an image and then paste what you just copied and set the refresh to 30 seconds. You can see there's the current weather. For the weather forecast, open Safari, copy the URL one more time, go back into the text edit document, use this code if you want the weather in Celsius, and this one if you want it in Fahrenheit. You can see here it says Fahrenheit, and here it says Celsius. Select my location and paste. Then copy all that. Go back into Geek Tool and add a second shell. Next, paste the script. You can close, see it says Fahrenheit. You can close that window. Set the refresh rate. To 30 seconds. You can see here the text is there but it's not visible. Set the font to 18. Change the color. Make it white so that you can see it. Next make, the, make it smaller so that you can hide all that junk. And drag it where you want. And there you have the weather on your desktop. That was a tutorial on how to get the weather on your desktop using Geek Tool.